leader Malcolm X would have turned 97 today. He visited Baltimore, Cambridge, Gwen Oak, at times a turmoil back in the 60s. And tonight, WMAR 2 News' Dave Detling is live with those who came out tonight to honor his spirit. David. Hey there, Jamie. Well, the Tendaya family, a nonprofit organization well known throughout Baltimore City. They are calling for more unity and, of course, asking people to be change agents, much like Malcolm X. And like you said, all on his birthday. You saw a spike leaves Malcolm X, uh, but encourage him to come, man. Also, we're doing a $50 uh, gift card giveaway. From giveaways to groceries, the Tendaya family nonprofit was in McEldry Park Thursday, drumming up community support and celebrating a black leader on his birthday. Malcolm X. Minister Malcolm X is one of our great leaders, our great heroes. And as we look at the issues that's in Baltimore City right now and the issues in McElderly Park, with the recent violence and the drugs and the things that's going on in McElderly Park, we could use a Malcolm X. So as you're watching this movie again, think about how am I going to better myself? How am I going to better the habits I have? Elijah Miles and the rest of the Tendaya family called on community members to be change agents. This comes on the heels of an unsolved shooting where a man armed with an assault rifle shot four people on North Rose Street, killing 25-year-old Sean Cummings. That crime happened earlier this month. Take responsibility for it. We're in this community, we live, we work here, and everything that happens here, we got to have a hands-on effort to fix the issues that we see. For the Tendaya family, change starts with some of its youngest participants, like nine-year-old Mason Young. His mom says the organization helps reinforce values taught at home and that these events help teach him the importance of community. It just sets the foundation for him to, to be a leader in the future, you know, to understand the importance of giving back to the community, of being involved, of being active, of participating, and being an example for his peers. And Jamie, like you said, Malcolm X would have turned 97 had he not been assassinated. Now, as for that shooting on North Rose Street earlier this month, still unsolved. If you have any information, police want to hear from you. Live in Baltimore City tonight, Dave Detling, WMAR 2 News. All right, Dave, thanks.